The sugar fiasco extravaganza. <laughs> Did you just gag? What's up everybody and welcome back to a video on my channel. Have you ever wondered what it's like to drink literal very berry Captain Crunch? It turns out 7-Eleven has a new Slurpee flavor. Isn't that right, Damien, who's off camera? Yeah. Yeah, Damien's off camera because he's being shy. We are going to 7-Eleven where they have a brand new very berry Captain Crunch flavored Slurpee. I love Captain Crunch, but it always rips up my mouth and stuff, you know? So we're gonna see what this tastes like. And he's gonna get a lemonade one. You're only on for a second. Oh, I walked into a tree. I'll be back in a second. So there was a little bit of a mix up. We got two. We were gonna share one. So now we're not. Right off the bat, I'm meltability. Um, Very. Meltability is like an F. For so this, we're also gonna try pink lemonade cookies, but that's not what the video is about. The video is about this. Yep, ready. Are you gonna try some of the slush part, I guess? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna cheers. Cheers. Mine just tastes like ice. Mine tastes like cereal. Oh, there's the cereal flavor. <laughs> I'm gonna try some of this juice at the bottom. It really does taste like cereal. Well, that's weird. I like it though. It's the aftertaste that tastes like cereal. It tastes like cereal milk. Oh. The way that Damien described it is he said it tastes like um, blue raspberry that they're like, that they messed up and they were like, oh, this tastes like cereal. Let's sell it. Give me brain freeze real bad. One of the other things I want to grade this on besides flavor, okay, what would you give it an A through F in flavor wise? In Flavor Town. Welcome to Flavor Town. Maybe like a seven and a half. I said A through F. Oh. <laughs> okay, what would you give it? An A through F in flavor wide. Maybe like a seven and a half. Maybe like a seven and a half. Maybe like a seven and a half. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. Mac was not her strong suit. I think I'd give it like a C plus. It's not gross, but it's not great either. But it's interesting. Damien's in the background sipping his own, always behind your head. The other thing we need to grade. So we've got, an, I'm giving an F on the meltability. The, yeah. the melt, yeah. Cause it's like literally have you tried 90 just, feet away. Have you tried just, yeah. It really is like a block away. Have you tried just the juice? Mm -hmm. I mean, it's like pop. C plus I say on the flavor. So now the other thing we need to grade is how much it died our mouth. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> well, they made my teeth look really white though. So I they mean. Actually, they look really blue in real life. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Even the, just everything in my mouth. So I give it an A plus on the on the tongue diability. You want me to take it out of your hand? Yes, please. Blech. Can we get it to focus? Pink lemonade cookies. Oh, my teeth look do look blue. I had some fun with the Smurf. Oh. Is it sour? They smell like lemons. Oh, that smells good. Okay, well, on a scale of if it stays together, no. Oh, they're literally all just disconnected. So just take one. They were 99 cents. They were 99 cents. Hater. I guess ding? I don't know. Oh, good. Hmm. It doesn't taste like anything to me. It's oh. Lemony. It tastes like a cotton candy lemon to me. Ah! It's okay. The mice <laughs> will get that. I don't know what it tastes like, but I like it. Want another one? And then he retreats back to the blurry background. Kind of just a slightly sour Oreo, I guess. Mmm, slightly sour Oreos. Yeah, tastes a little bit like Sprite cheese. On a flavor of one to, on a flavor scale of A to F, I give it a seven and a half. I think it tastes a little bit lemony. It tastes sour, but that's about it. Like, I don't know, it tastes vanilla. Yeah, did you say the vanilla Oreos? Tastes like regular Oreos, they die pink. Tastes a little lemony, snickety. <laughs> Oreo cream is supposed to be soft. I literally just bit into this and it crumbled. A dollar, 7-Eleven. But you know what? 7-Eleven, sponsor my video, please. Please. Oh, so many sugary flavors. This whole, um, what was I gonna say? Sugar, fiesta, extravaganza. Extravaganza. If you had to rate this trip to 7-Eleven overall, A through F, not a seven and a half, what would you give it? I'm thinking like a D. Um, I would give it an A because I didn't have to do any work. I just had to eat. <laughs> In terms of flavor, I'd give it a solid B plus. What? What? Because what here tasted like a B plus to you? Well, this was a C plus, and I really liked the cookies. So what? That was a... 
When I give an F to you, meltability. Meltability. Okay, okay. I, I still give it a D plus. Hmm. D plus. <laughs> I give it a three. Three out of ten. Cassidy, what is your overall score? A B plus. Damien, what would you have given the trip, even though you didn't really try everything? Um, I tried everything. A D plus. D plus. And you, Kevin? I think I'm gonna give it a D plus. A I mean. Plus? Listen, the cookies weren't great or awful. The drink wasn't great or awful, but the situation was just kind of weird. So I'm gonna give it a D plus. That's all I have to say. There's no other uh, cool flavors at, of Slurpees right now at 7-Eleven, but there is lots of other crazy foods. So if you'd like us to try the other- Those buffalo chicken dip chips are so good. If you'd like us to try the other weird flavored foods at 7-Eleven and do one of these weird standing videos eating foods, just let us know, comment below, let us know. I said that already. The sugar's getting to me. I'm getting sugar high already. Lots of options. Then raspberry Kit Kats. Raz they didn't have the Raspberry Kit Kats. They might have next time. Raspberry Kit Kats. Birthday cake. These. Cookies. Hot Italian sausage chips. Italian. Italian sausage <laughs> chips. Thanks for watching. If you want to watch us eat more weird foods, comment below. Let us know. And... If you <laughs> That'll do, pig. Oh, I'm just gonna say, bless you, ew.